What is poppin' Genshin gang today? We've got a great video for you guys. And before we start, I wanted to let you guys know if you are a part of the 80% who are not subscribed, but also watch my content, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Go ahead and do it. I'll wait. All right, let's go. So today's topic of conversation is going to be a little bit of a speculation and um, a little bit of wanting and wishing. As we know with Dragonspine 1.2, we got the ice and the hydro set from the newest domain. Now, since Dragonspine is a, I guess you would call it an in-between type content or, or, you know, expansion of the map, I would want to know what are they going to do with domains going forward? I personally think that there's a lot of room for improvement with artifacts and, and, and how they're implemented in the game. And I just wanted to go over some sets that I think would be very, very beneficial to the game. We want to start off with what could possibly be coming with the Inazuma domain. I always default to Kachin because she's an Electro character. So with Kachin being a crit, crit damage heavy unit, I would like to see Inazuma come out with a crit rate and crit damage set uh, respectively and the way i would set this up is for the crit rate set i would have uh the two piece would raise the crit rate 15 percent and the four piece set would be upon crit raises the entire team crit rate by 20 percent for 10 seconds it can only be activated every 20 seconds i feel like that's very fair i feel like that's a really really good critical set that you could use for you know anybody that that needs crit like uh kaching like klee and more more characters that are going to be coming out in the future that do that the crit damage set would be for the two piece raise crit damage by 30 percent because i do believe that the common rule of law is for every crit damage percent or, or crit rate percent you want double the crit damage so if you already have good crit pieces, you would go with the crit damage set, obviously. And this would make people almost broken. I think this would make people broken, but I do believe that going forward with content, it's going to get a lot harder. So you're gonna to need to make your units hit a lot harder. So with the crit damage set, two piece would be um, raised crit damage by 30%. Four piece will be a 40% chance to cause additional AOE damage equal to 70 percent of the base attack and this can be activated every 10 seconds so this is similar to how the uh prototype um well it was the prototype animus i think it's called the prototype rancor i'm not sure but the prototype claymore uh similar to that effect on just on an artifact so that would be that would be pretty that would pretty be pretty good <laughs> pretty good now those coming in in Azuma, well, I'm not going to say they're coming, but those would be a great addition to have those in domains in, in Azuma. I do believe that, you know, we can go, we can take this a little bit further and we can add more sets to come in the future. Obviously, we don't know what Dendro does. I do, I think the only thing that we can speculate on is it's got some type of burning property. So I'm not going to speculate on what Dendro can do today. I would like to flesh out a little bit more for support characters. And I would like to turn our interest to support and sustain. So with the addition of the crit damage and the crit rate set, we would go with the speed set. Now what this would do, the two piece would increase attack and movement speed for 10%, but it cannot stack with the same buff. So like the animal buff and all that kind of stuff, it would not stack with it. It would still stay a stagnant 10% movement speed, no matter what. But for the four piece, elemental burst and elemental skill cooldown decreased by 10% and generates three elemental orbs every time an elemental skill is used. So this would be absolutely amazing on Albedo. Absolutely amazing, absolutely busted. And while the 10% speed doesn't stack, the elemental orbs do so say for instance you know you get three off of his his elemental skill you'll get an extra three just for equipping this set and then he would be on an infinite loop with his ult that would be that would, that would be broken but that would be crazy it would absolutely be crazy and i would absolutely love to use a speed set 
on on out Al, on somebody like albedo who who does like has a energy recharge energy recharge energy recharge so that would be great and the final set that i want to talk about is a lifesteal set so you have someone who is very damage heavy but not they're but they're squishy i would dare say uh clee is 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 a very good unit for this as well as you know the crit rate set two piece would absorb five percent of damage dealt as health i i was i'm not sure how the calculations are going i am not a mathematician but five percent seems fair for the amount of dps um somebody can do in this game so it's per hit per you know every every time you see like a damage chunk come out that's how much would be going back into the character for as health so i feel like that is a little bit like i say i don't know the percentages of five percent of a thousand it's like what five percent of a thousand is was it five health no 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 no. that's 50 health 50 health five percent of a thousand is 50. so every time you do five that's 50 health i feel like that's fair i think that's actually fair that's not too bad that's not too bad um but for the four piece uh when using a shield when you have a shield equipped from like a, a drop or a crystal anything like that 50 percent of the damage absorbed is counted to health oh uh, not counted converted to health i can't read my own handwriting if there is a you have a shield and it takes what 250 damage half of that half of 250 125 <laughs> 125 of that is converted back into your health on top of the five percent that your the damage that you're doing is health so just for convenience sake you can have somebody who is like a, ver a very glass cannon character put on this lifesteal set and they're good to go they're good to go so um in closing i want to know what kind of sets you guys can come up with how how it will work with the meta and all that kind of stuff for the most part besides the crit set i think most of these sets are fair i i don't think that anything would be you know out of place with these sets um like i say the crit damage set would have to be tweaked a little bit I, i'm not sure how that would work on the math end but in my head it sounds really good so um with that i'm gonna get up on out of here man thank you guys so much for watching it is me your boy mikey j in the 11 place to be and as always guys peace